Hey guys, what's up? I'm Zephyr Sonic, and welcome back to more Pokemon Stadium. So in the last episode, we took on the Round 2 Gym Leader Castle, defeated the Elite Four and the Champion, and now we're going to be taking on the Round 2 Stadium. And so, you see the same cups as the same from the first round, only increased difficulty here in the second round. So, the first one we're going to be tackling is the Petite Cup. And, so yeah, so we're going to battle, and I've already got a registered set that I'm going to use. Now, I will show you guys how to get the Surfing Pikachu that is available in this round, uh, that I will tell you more about later, but that's not until the Prime Cup. So, I'll get to that when we get there. But one of the things you definitely do not want to do is have a registered team set. You want to pick them from your own game and do it that way, because if it's registered, then no, it won't work. So, this is the team that I would recommend that you select for the battle, and let's go against the Round 2 Petite Cup. Yeah, I'm not, I'm, most of the time I'm not even going to register them though, so, uh, yeah, just makes it easier sometimes. But, uh, anyways, we're going to be going with Spiro, Horsey, and the Nidoran Female. Let's get underway with Pokemon Tournament Petit Cup, the tournament for unevolved Pokemon. Let's see how much fight the cutest Pokemon can put up. And so Magikarp is going to be first. That's a that's a one fast Magikarp. A decent hit. Vigorous attack. Severe hit. So yeah, so it did some really good damage with uh, Spiro. Fireworks <coughs> are flying in this battle. Oops. Wait. Oh, no wonder. What's that? There, it's a hit. All right, we should be able to take it out with another double, double edge. Man. What will the next Pokemon be? Yes, what will it be? Oddish. Oh, this is a fight between two different <coughs> types of Pokemon. All right, well, let's just fly up in the air. It's probably going to go for Stun Spore. Yeah, it does, but it's going to miss because I'm up in the air. Stun Spore wow. It didn't work. Neither one is conceding an inch. So come on, fly. We definitely need a critical to take it out. There it goes. We don't get it, but uh, let's see if we can dodge this. Stun Spore. What will it do? Oops, it's paralyzed. So no, we don't, and it's probably going to go for a Mega Drain. Yeah, no acid. What's this? Alright, we're definitely going to need to get an attack off, which we get it, so... That? That's a good hit. Oh, Next, please. Down and out? There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. Bell Sprout oh, is Sprout. the last one. Um, the remaining Pokemon count is 3 to 1. The battle has become one-sided. I'll go with my Neater and Female. It'll take him a little while to take Neater and Female out. To its oh, it's a Neater and Female! But he goes for the Acid, so... What now? It's not very effective. And I've got Blizzard. How will this swap affect the outcome? I have quite a guess to outspeed me, and he goes first with the Sun Spore. And then he missed, yeah. So, Blizzard! Perfect game! The intense battle continues! Now, this will be interesting to see if I can get him down with another Blizzard. Now, he's just gonna go for Rap. What'll it do? Watch the me! It can't make a move! 
Let's see. Fireworks are flying in this battle. But from here, I can reset the battle phase and go into horsey. The only thing is, is that bell sprout gonna outspeed my oh, horsey? horsey? Will this Pokemon swap change uh, the flow of battle? Let's go for it. Yes. So that's it for the first battle. And there goes the battle. All right, so the bug boy is defeated and we got our continue. So moving on, let's go to battle two. Battle two and the Lord. And let's see, we're gonna be going with uh, Spiro, Diglitz, and Voltorb. What kind of battle can we expect to see? Begin round two. Man, so it's gonna be PJ. Yeah, has Spiro doing really well. And then we got the sand attack to worry about. Blinding sand attack! Accuracy took a hit! Fireworks are flying in this battle! And now he's just gonna go for quick attack. What'll it do? A decent hit! That did really good for a quick attack. Now we just got a hit. Double A! So... Who's coming out next? Bulbasaur. Oh, Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur. I am this down in accuracy stage. Two different types of Pokemon. Uh... But I'll go with Fly. Hopefully we'll hit. He's probably gonna go for Leech Seed or something. Okay, Razor Leaf. What next? The crowd's excitement is building over this hot battle! Now we are under the sand attack drop at or accuracy, so let's see if we hit a yes. Super effective. That really helps! Okay, now he goes for Leech Seed. Leech Seed! There, it's a hit! Um... Neither one is conceding an inch! Alright, let's go with the double edge. Come on, yes, got ya. Gotcha. And it's down. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. And let's see who's the last one. Ditto. Uh the remaining Pokemon count is three to one. Yeah, let's double the edge the ditto. There's the attack. Major damage. We might get another continue here. Ugh. It's gonna cut it close though. E. Wow, it transformed! What a furious battle! Yeah, I'm gonna go into Diglett now. The trainer's changing Pokemon. Oh, it's Diglett! The move failed to glitch. He tried to mirror move me. How will this swap affect the outcome? That's funny. Rock slide. Roll with rock slide. And that'll do it for battle two. Oh, is it down and out? And there goes the battle! So, who? Two continues. Didn't break too much of a sweat, but, uh, if you miss, that can be completely different. So, anyways, let's go after Battle 3 and the Sailor Mon. And here we're going to be going with, uh, Voltorb, Ghastly, and Diglett. 
upcoming battle looks promising. We're into round three. Now, ones like ah, ones like Voltorb can really hit if uh, if they hit. Here it comes, Thunder! Whoa! Looks like a bad Pokemon choice. That was quick. Down already. This is a it wild one from the dropped workout. my mouse and stuff while I was recording some oh, live recording. But as I was saying, how will the type difference affect that? Is that, yeah, I mean the thunder. It, if it hits, Secret it attack. can really help. But uh, but target. if it doesn't, like it did just there, it can really come back to haunt you. In the moaning. Like that didn't help me at all. Getting a crit on me. Fireworks are flying in this battle. I think it's got quick, quick attacks so that we really need to hit here. Oop, that's a miss. Yeah, you see what I mean? Major that didn't help me at all. Oh, it's down. What will the next Pokemon be? I guess it'll go going to Ghastly. Oh, it's Ghastly! The Pokemon are entirely different types. So we'll go with the thunder. There's the attack. A decent hit. Yeah, we can take that really well. What's that? A savage hit. Well, that's what we gotta do. Neither one is conceding an eight. Now we should be able to just use Mega Drain and finish it off. Ah, but it's going underground. Going underground rat. What'll it do? Oh, the attack missed! The intense battle continues! Alright, then I'll just switch to Diglett. The trainer's changing Pokemon. Oh, it's Diglett! Ah! Severe hit! Yeah, from Will a rat. The Pokemon swap change the flow of battle? So we should be able to finish it with ah, but it's got quick there, attacks. Quick attack. That's a good hit. And it's down. Ah. Uh, There's only one Pokemon left in reserve. Well, I guess that means I'm gonna lose here. There's nothing left in reserve. It's one Pokemon against two now. The tense battle continues. Yeah, I'm probably gonna lose. How's that? Miss the target. Fireworks are flying in this battle. Let's see if Ghastly can brace the dig. Dig this. That's the weak spot. Nope. Oh, is it down and out? So we just lost. <sighs> Things just didn't go my way there. So let's try that again. Let's go with Ghastly, Voltorb, and Diglett. The upcoming battle looks promising. We're into round three. I hate how Voltorb just wants to miss sometimes. Now let's see if we can get our continue back that we lost. Whoa, looks like a bad Pokemon choice. Yeah. Ooh, that was quick. Down already. This is a wild one from the word go. Oh, the litter and male. Nice, the neater and male. Pokemon count I'll just continue three, with the thunder. Two. This battle is still up in the air. Yeah. Now we're doing much better. Down with one hit. <laughs> much, much better. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. That's why I think I like Ghastly more than Voltorb. Oh, and the shelter we should be able to easily sweep. 
The remaining Pokemon count is three to one. See, we're gonna we the lost, has one and now point. we're gonna sweep. Ah! Okay, now target. we're not, not yet, not yet. Super Sonic. The move failed to click. Fireworks are flying in this battle. So let's try that again. Whoa! Oh, it's another. <sighs> Jeez. What's that? It's confused. The crowd's excitement is building over this hot battle. All right, come on, Ghastly. Wow. You can do it. Yeah. And that's it for battle three. It's a one-hit wonder. And there goes the battle. And so we are now ready for battle number four. Against the nerd! And let's see... We are going to go with, uh... We're gonna go with... Horsey... Ghastly and Diglett. And it's going to be Voltorb. So. Diglett. I was thinking he was going to go for Explosion, but we'll see. Or the Electric Attack. Oh, it's Diglett! Yeah, okay. Here's the first move! So we'll make another switch into Ghastly. Another Pokemon chain. Oh, it's Ghastly. Man, that's one down. A massive explosion. Oh, nothing but air. Wow, going down. Hmm. Uh. What will the next Pokemon be? That is so predictable. Oh, it's Geo. Geo, dude. Um. How will the type difference affect that? Yeah, definitely want to switch to Horsey here. The Pokemon returns to its Pokeball. Alright, it's going for Earthquake. I wouldn't expect for it to go for Explosion again, so... Yeah, I wouldn't switch. A Bubble Beam might take it out. I would think it would. Yeah. And so who is the last There's one? A difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. Of course the last one won't be able to explode because this is last, so even if he did, that means he would oh, lose. Oh. The remaining Pokemon count is three to one. I'll the leave Horsey in. I'll have to. What'll it do? Alright, so going into Ghastly, I need to get it taken Here's out. The remaining so, Confuse Ray, and then I'm gonna go for the, the Nightshade. Now, hopefully, it'll hurt itself. Alright. That'll give me some, uh. Breathing space, so yeah, we just need to get two nightshades, and that What's should that? be it. A decent hit. Uh -oh, it's Are you eggs confused? Neither one is conceding an inch. 
So one more nightshade, and that's it. Nightshade. There, it's a hit. So that does it for Battle Four. Oh! why he was doing that, though. I don't know why he didn't go for Psychic. That was interesting. But anyways, Battle 4 complete, and now it's time for Battle 5. And here we are going to go with the following. We're going to go with Ghastly, Voltorb, and Diglett. We're in the last half of the tournament. Things will get quite hot. <coughs> Begin round five. And so... Let's see, we're gonna go with Thunder with Ghastly, and we should be able to take it out. Miss the target. But we definitely won't like that. It's Pharaoh underground. Are they testing each other's strength? Uh, yeah, it'll have to be Diglett. Pokemon returns to its Pokeball. Yeah, you can't be doing that. Oh, it's Diglett! Vigorous attack! A savage hit! How will this swap affect the outcome? Alright, so I'll switch back into Ghastly and try it again. Another Pokemon chain! And we will see what happens a decent hit will this pokemon swap change the flow of battle all right come on thunder hit this time Whoa! yes wow, take it down with one hit no that's the way we're supposed to do what things will the next pokemon be? oh it's holy holy wag how will the type difference affect that? All right, Thunder, do your... Ah, I guess to go first. There's the attack! There, it's a hit! All right, we can take a couple of bubble beams unless they crit. Here it comes! Thunder! Whoa! Looks like a bad Pokemon choice! Yeah! God, it's a one-hit wonder! There's a difference in the number of reserved Pokemon. And Goldine. Oh, Goldie. So we just need to land one one. more thunder. The battle has become one sided. Come on, we just need to land one more. Yes. So that is battle five. That didn't take much. And there goes the battle. So yeah, so we got our continue, and I will be right back. And we're back, so uh, I had to go in be right back mode because I had to go eat dinner last night, and that was last night, and I was in, uh, I was doing live recording, and, of course, I'm live recording again now, but uh, I chose to go ahead and do the next three battles, being, though, that I win them uh, tomorrow, which is today, so I've had my coffee and I'm energized, so let's take on Battle 6. We haven't won this cup yet. That is our mission. So, in this battle, we're going to go with Voltorb, Ghastly, and Horsey. Field is thinning out. We're into round six. Now, if Cubone starts, that can be that could be a bit of a problem. So I'm gonna go ahead and paralyze uh, Charmander. Get you Oops, it's Hoping to get a full paralysis. No, we don't. They're both being cautious. Um. I guess I'll go in with Horsey. The trainer's changing Pokemon. 
So let's see what happens. Okay, fully paralyzed, good. It's paralyzed on the spot. That'll help. How will this swap affect the outcome? Alrighty. Vigorous attack. Perfect day. Yeah. It can't make a move. That's what I'm what a furious battle. talking about. Yeah, and it'll either be Charmander or Cubone that you'll face. But I think Cubone would be a little bit more annoying than Charmander. What will the next Pokemon be? Okay, Clefairy. Uh, I might as well leave Horsey in. This is a fight between two different types of Pokemon. Just to make it more difficult, I'm gonna smoke screen. Yeah, you just had to get a critical on me. Alright, um... Be Voltorb. And I'll also paralyze you. What's that? So at least it's under an accuracy drop if it misses. A decent hit. Which uh does okay damage. Fireworks are flying in this battle. Now come on, Voltorb. What's this? Oh, the That's hit. not gonna help! What now? Oops, Haha. -ha. Neither one is conceding an inch. Come on, Thunder! What's that? Oh, it's well, in those turns, I could have gotten two what screeches off, possibly, and got it with oh, takedown. This one missed two. The heated battle rages on. This is what I mean. The what attacks like Thunder. Yeah, finally you hit. All right. Whew. Well, that's a bit of a breather. Both Pokemon appear equally fit. Now, hit it this time again. What now? Or else I kill you! Well, just when I say that, it's a critical, just when it mattered. Thank you, Great Ball of Ball! Okay, the last one is Growlithe. The remaining Pokemon stock is two to one. And I'm definitely paralyzing you. Uh, definitely. It's got, uh, Dragon Rage, I believe. And that's we'll do an instant 40 damage. Oh, but it's gonna go underground. Okay, well... There's nothing I can really do except hope he gets fully paralyzed. Come on, fully prep, parala- Nah, man. Yeah. Well, let's go with Ghastly and see what happens. We're down to one Pokemon aside. I'm gonna go for the Confuse Ray. Oh, it's Ghastly! There's just one Pokemon aside now. The battle is coming right down to the wire. So, yeah, we're gonna need things to happen here for me to be able to win. Oh boy. We will not withstand another Dragon Rage because we're obviously under 40 HP, <clears throat> so we need to hit this Thunder. A critical hit would be super duper. And we get it! So. Wow, that's Battle 6. <clears throat> so just when it mattered, yes. So now we're ready to take on Battle 7.
And here we are going to be going with Diglett, Ghastly, and Voltorb. This is it, the semi-final! No one wants to lose having come this far. So it's gonna be Pikachu that starts. <clears throat> gonna go for the quick attack. Here's the first move. A decent hit. And so we shall go for dig. And now, so what is the last gonna do? Okay, double team. Well, dig glitz, you know what you gotta do. Because those quick attacks are gonna be very annoying. Yeah, see, it's just gonna keep it up. Hang on, okay. Well, Diglett's gonna have to get it right this time. Now, come on. Yes. Now, take it out. Yeah. Whew. What will the next Pokemon be? That one was a bit scary. Oh, it's Diglett. And now it's her Diglett. It has to make up for lost ground. And unfortunately, we are at a huge disadvantage. Because Ghastly and them the would not be able to withstand anything. Which Pokemon is coming out? So it's going to be Ghastly. Oh, it's Ghastly! And we'll just have to see what happens, I guess. I'll go for the Confuse Ray. She's probably got, yeah, I don't think Ghastly's gonna survive. Nope, it's over. So we are gonna quit. There's only one Pokemon left in reserve. We'll have to give up a continue, though. Oh, it's Voltor! It's one Pokemon against two. So, yep, this is gonna cost us a continue. So, let's try her on again. Uh, okay, this time we're gonna go with uh, Voltorb Ghastly. Actually, no, wait. We're gonna go with... Uh, We're gonna go with Diglett, Ghastly, and Horsey. This is it, the semi-final! No one wants to lose having come this far. And so it's uh, Pikachu again. And we will dig right as soon as she goes for the quick attack. Here's the first move. A decent hit. So underground we go. Battle. And she is switching. Pokemon returns to its Pokeball. Oh, it's Eevee. Ah, it's Eevee. Alright, come on, Diglett. Smack that What's Eevee. Alright. Okay, I guess. Will this Pokemon swap change the flow of battle? We are going to go with Ghastly. The trainer's changing Pokemon. It's really good to pick Ghastly against Eevee. Oh, it's Ghastly! Ah, she's just gonna go for the sand attack. Sand attack. Accuracy took a hit. How will the swapped Pokemon fight? So we'll get a Confuse Ray. Hopefully it hits. Confuse Ray. It's confused. And now hopefully it hurts itself. It do? That doesn't, but. Yeah, it's working. Fireworks are flying in this battle. All right, well, Ghastly has some work to do. Come on, Thunder. What's this? Oh, the attack missed. It shook off in confusion. The Pokemon feeling it. Is that all you're gonna do? Either one is conceding an inch. All right, we'll put it back under the Confuse Ray. What next? The move failed to click. What'll it do? It's still oh, man. 
The heated battle rages on. Try that again. What this? Okay. Now hurt yourself. What now? All right, I'm gonna the switch here. Must be shot. The intense battle continues. Um, I got gonna go into horsey. Oh, there's going to be a change of Pokemon. Oh, it's horsey. What's that? Yeah, Eevee's that doing really good to, uh... How will this swap affect the outcome? To avoid that. Now I'm just pretty much gonna go for a smoke screen. Haha. -ha. That's what you get. Alright, so I'm gonna get one smoke screen off. The smoke screen went off! Accuracy took a hit. The crowd's excitement is building over this hot battle. And then switch back to Ghastly to, uh... The Pokemon yeah. To its Pokeball. Neutralize the sand attack. Uh-oh, it's confused! Whew, alrighty. How will the Swap Pokemon fight? Now I'm just wondering what her last one is, and I'm hoping it's not Diglett. Okay, she switches. Uh, I'm guessing back to Pikachu. So, let's see what happens. Come on, paralyze that Double Pikachu! Alright, um... Will this Pokemon swap change the flow of battle? Yeah, we're gonna go into, back into Diglett. Here's a Pokemon change. Whew, this is a tough battle. I can tell you that. How will this swap affect the outcome? And she's probably gonna go for, yeah, another quick attack. What's this? A decent hit! We might take one more quick attack if this dig does not hit. What a furious battle! Alright, come on, hit Kapowitz! Yes! Perfect game. And it's down! Hoo-hoo, yeah! That's what I'm talking what about. Will the next Pokemon be? All right, is it back into Eevee? Yes, it is. Well, we are switching. How will the type difference affect that? Back into Gasly. Oh, there's going to be a change of Pokemon. If her last one is Diglett, this could get really bad. Cause she could what take now? my horsey out with a critical. Miss the target. How will the and that's the scary Pokemon thing of it all. Fight. And he'd be, he'd be, he's faster than me. So yeah, so we'll take out Eevee. Oh, is it down and, out? and now, I await the last There's Pokemon. What is it? Anything but Diglett. Anything but Diglett. Okay, it's Vulpix. Oh, Alright, we should have this. The remaining Pokemon count is three to So one. I'll go for the Confuse the Race. She'll probably do the same thing if she's got it. it do? It's yeah, she's gonna go for Dig. Alright, so Fireworks are flying in this battle. To get the continue, hopefully. Going into horsey. Pokemon to its Pokeball. Even on a crit, I, do, I highly doubt that Vulpix is going to take out Horsey. Yeah! Uh oh, it's confused! Will this Pokemon swap change the flow of battle? So, a Bubble Beam should take it out the rest of its hit points. A quick Attack's all it's going to go for. There, it's a hit. So, Bubble Beam, and we'll have we'll get our continue back that we lost. Bubble beam. And that is Battle 7. Oh. Alright, so the last Bell Patel fight plus the victories can also kind of be decided depending on what they throw out because it's not always the same starting Pokemon. I guess it depends upon the trainer and, you know, what they like to go with. But, uh, 
yeah, that's what I'm saying. It, it can be how fortunate you are through here. That can be, you could use the same pokes I am, and you could lose all of your continues a couple of times and then eventually get it. But that's what I'm saying. That's how one-sided it can be. It can go from one end to the other, the other and back if you miss critical attacks. So, yeah. And we are now ready to take on the final battle in the round two Petite Cup. And it's against the Pokemaniac, so you know things are about to get crazy. And we are going to be going with, uh... Ghastly, Horsey, and Diglett. This is it! The final battle! Who will pass to the glory of the championship? And it's gonna be far-fetched. And, uh, I think he's gonna switch. Uh we'll go, so we'll go with hor Horsey. Changing Pokemon. That Pokemon must not have been the right choice. Oh, Horsey! The yep. other trainer also changes. Gotta be Sand Shrew. Oh, it's Sand Shrew! Are they testing each other's strength? So he'll probably switch again, but we'll see. Okay, no. Oh, so I'll go stick with Bubble Beam then. There it goes. And yeah, I've just barely hung on. There's the attack. The savage hit. All right, so Sand Shrew is going to uh, power versus power. go down. And I really want to save Horsey Bubble for Dratini if he has it in. What will the next Pokémon be? Oh, it's Omina! It has to make up for lost ground. The remaining Pokémon count Which is it's, uh, 3 to 2. This Omanite, so... Let's see... We're gonna go into Ghastly. The Pokémon returns to its Pokéball. And uh, let's see. Ah! We do. Um, let's just go with the, the thunder. What do do? Come on! Yeah, not a critical. Definitely take it out. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. And we more than likely should have this. There's nothing left in reserve. So yeah, Farfetch'd is left in, uh... The remaining Pokemon count all we need is one Thunder. One. The battle has become one side. So, come on. If we can hit it, it should be over. Miss the target. Okay, it's not over yet. It's the okay, it's gonna fly. Fireworks are flying in this battle. So, well, it'll have to be a uh, horsey, I guess. The trainer's changing Pokemon. We'll take the fall. Here comes the aerial attack. There, it's a hit. Oh, <sighs> it's down. Which Pokemon is coming out? All right, come on, uh, Gasly, let's do this. The remaining Pokemon stock is two to one. The combatants are making. Come on, all we need is one Thunder. There it goes. Yes. Go down. Yes. That's it. Round two, Petite Cup cleared. So yeah, that was some uh, hard-fought battles, and yeah, so defeated all eight of them. So yeah, Ghastly, Horsey, Diglett, S Jack Sparrow, 
Voltorb. And the Nidoran female, which I didn't really have to use. And so there you go, Petite Cup round two cleared. Yeah, it's nice. Do 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 do. Ah, such lovely music, isn't it? All right, so well, that clears the round to Petite Cup, and that is going to do it for this episode. And in the next episode, we're gonna take on the round two. Pika Cup, a cup tournament open to the lowest level Pokemon strategy is the key here. So, if you guys enjoyed this episode, don't forget get to hit that thumbs up like button. And the comment question for this episode is, uh, let's see, trying to think here. Uh, what's your favorite all-time Pokemon game? What, which one's your favorite? Like yellow, red, blue, all the all those, including this one, Stadium, Stadium 2. Which one is your favorite? Leave it in the comments below. And so yeah, in the next episode, we'll take on the round two Petite Cup. So until then, I'm Zephyr Sonic, and I'll catch you guys next time.